Good morning, Wonder Hearts. Here I am, Laura here, normally on Brighton Beach, and today I am off of the coast of Mexico, Belize Island. Yes, I'm on a cruise. <laughs> the sea, look at that behind me. Isn't that amazing? Just so beautiful. I'm here on a course, on a retreat, having the most incredible time expanding my heart and my mind so that I can be more and bring more of my work to, um, to this life. I'm gonna walk a little so that you can see the view behind here. Having an incredible time and really opening up to the possibilities of life, being given this amazing opportunity to be here. And the sea, I mean, I know Brighton is amazing and so is here. The thing is that we have this opportunity in life, you know, to really take and say yes to all of the possibilities that are here for us in every moment. And sometimes we have to say yes before we even know where or how or how or, or when or, or what it would take to make something happen very often we we need to say yes when we really believe that everything's showing us that it looks like a no that it looks like it couldn't be possible that's how i planned my way to coming here was by not allowing that part of my mind that is always looking for a reason why it shouldn't be happening to be the directive force. I allow my heart to know that it, it could happen, anything can happen. The infinite is always working in its way that it wants to provide for us in the most amazing way to, to give us what we need on our journey to empower us for our next step. So it's when we say yes without even believing that it could even happen and just lay it aside and let it go and allow the divine to really take over. That's when it all comes together in the letting go, the letting go of our expectation and what our mind thinks is possible because that's only a minute part of what really is possible. In the infinite, it is all possible and it is all available. And so what are you saying yes to and yet in your heart saying no to because you, you really may not even believe that this could be possible for you. You know, for months I've been on Brighton Beach making videos uh, with the gorgeous sea behind and here I am now off the coast of Mexico and coming up to Belize Island. Never really thinking in my heart, you know, that it wouldn't happen just allowing the space for it to be and here it is here I am here I am so my question for you is what is there that you are not holding space for in your life that you believe maybe couldn't be possible in the situation that you're in whatever it is not judging it big or small that you can turn around and allow the divine to really take charge and really be the presence that's allowing it to come through for your life without you judging it, judging the situation, looking at the past, how it's been and thinking, no, it can't be like that because it's always been like that. But really letting go and allowing life to bring it to you in the way that is really for your highest and best in a way that you can't imagine. So get your piece of paper, meditate on that for a few minutes. Is there something that you are not quite believing in your life that could be possible for you and something that you really, really, really want to happen for your life experience? Whatever it is, don't put a judgment on the size of it because life isn't. And just look at that thing and allow yourself to accept it and allow yourself to be the receiver of that thing and to allow 
spirit, the divine life, to bring it into your experience because you are opening up to the possibility of it. That's what I did to get myself here. And it was effortless because I trusted and believed and had faith in the whole thing and allowed it to be. And so as per usual, I'm gonna flip my camera around so that you can get a view and take a few moments just taking in the landscape of Mexico.